Hello friends, welcome to our channel. Today in this video, we are going to discuss about the 2023 Hyundai i20 N-Line spied with Arai emission testing equipment. The South Korean brand currently offers a CNG with Grand i10 Nias and Ara. That said, CNG's uh, portfolio is not as robust as Maruti Suzuki. Also, there is a new shift in BS6 emission norms that require powertrains to meet the RDE conditions from April 2023. Most sub 2 liter engines are said to be reworked to comply if demand permits. If not, such vehicles will be axed. There are 17 vehicles that are set to be axed soon. We are brushing yeah, with uh, both CNG and RDE norms for a good reason. Hyundai i20N line test, uh, i20N line test mule has been spotted on road with emission testing equipment. It has the sticker on test by Arai. This i20 N line test mule could be a CNG variant or existing version doing compliance test with the uh, upcoming RDE conditions. Offering CNG by fuel option on entry level hatchbacks and budget cars is understandable. With ever rising fuel prices and eco consciousness, there has been a paradigm shift in the automotive bubble in the past uh, recent past. Now CNG tech has uh, crept up the ranks from the entry level cars to premium hatchbacks, premium MPVs and even compact SUVs. With Balino and Glancer starting the trend in premium hatchback space, even Tata Ultras and Hyundai i20 seem to be jumping on the bandwagon. New spy charts of Hyundai, Hyundai i20 and line with emission testing equipment hint to us that Hyundai wants to make its offering a fun alternative to rivals with non-turbo engines. Currently factory fitted CNG variants from Hyundai cost around Rs 1 lakh to 1.1 lakh on Aura and Nias. We can expect a similar price strategy with i20 N-Line CNG variants as well. i20 N-Line starts from Rs 10 lakh for N6 IMT variant and goes till Rs 12.11 lakhs for the top spec N8 variant with DCT. Price pump of up to Rs 10.1 lakh is expected with CNG. 2023 RDE norms to meet the new sticker uh, RDE conditions under phase 2 of a BS6 trans transition. Hyundai is likely to make its peppy 1 liter um, engine comply. It's already known that Hyundai is axing the 1.5 liter diesel option with i20. The 1 liter turbocharged 3 cylinder engine from the Hyundai does duties in a lot of vehicles like Venue, i20, Nias, Ara, Verna, and its sister brand Kia Sonnet. It is logical that Hyundai will keep it this 1 litre turbo petrol alive and transition to new sticker emission policies that are set to take effect from April 2023. This 998cc engine makes close to 120bhp of power and 170Nm of torque in the Hyundai N i20 N line. This engine is coupled to either a 6 speed IMT or 7 speed DCT. Please stay tuned to our channel for further updates. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel.